All right, guys, here's a short video to show you how to do the software updates onto the USB drive. What we need to start off with first is we need to go onto your web browser. And go to the Khan Audio website. We need to go to the downloads page. In the download page, you'll find all our software updates for the FG Falcon, BABF Falcon, and VE Commodore. We'll click on the FG Falcon one. You'll come up with a folder with three folders in there and one file called base AB, apk the base apk file is for doing a can bus update only we will start with the can bus updates we'll just click on the can bus folder we go up to the top corner and download click on direct download and it will save it to our download folder the same with the MCU update. Right hand click up there, go direct download. It will download to your download folder in your computer. System update, the same thing again. There is five files that need to be downloaded. So if you click on the right hand corner and go direct download, that will download all the files at once. And same with base APK. We just go there and click on download. Click on direct download and that will download it. Once they are downloaded, we will go over to our PC. We'll click on downloads. And you'll have your three files here. Your system, your CAN bus and your MCU. What we need to do is we need to extract them. So we'll click on the CAN bus file, we right click our mouse, click on extract all, click extract, it will open up a folder with the file in there saying CAN app.bin. What we will do now is we'll grab our USB, we'll plug it into the computer. Right, it is important that you format the USB before you do these updates as well. Format will need to be FAT32, we will go through this now. There's our USB drive, you right click that, you go down to Format, FAT32, press Start, it will come up with a warning telling you that all your data will be erased on this, on this drive, click OK to continue, and now it's formatted it. Now we need to do the updates one by one or this will not work at all. So we'll go to our download folder. A folder where it says Canvas. Right click our mouse. Go to Send To. USB E Drive. And that will send it to our USB Drive. And the update's ready. We will do the same for the system update. We'll just format this drive again. So we've got our system update there. We right click on that. We go extract all. In the bottom, click extract. This is a fairly large file, so it might take a minute to extract it and the copy over. Okay. 
Right now we've got the system file update. It's the same process with the Canvas update. We just copy them all over to the main USB. As I said, this is a fairly big file, so this will take a couple of minutes to do. Right now that our files have been downloaded, we'll go back to our USB drive. This is USB drive E. And you'll have your system updates there. Once you've got the updates on that, we need to inject the USB drive. So we right click that, we go eject. And then we go over to our vehicle and upload, sorry, download the new system update to our units. System update will take about five or ten minutes to complete. Mm -hmm. If you've got any issues with the updates, please let us know.